Thanks. Some big changes for medical marijuana users in Georgia. The life of a card granting them access to low levels of THC has nearly tripled. Atlanta News First, Bridget Spencer is live outside of Fine Fettle Dispensary in Smyrna. Bridget, the state says this will make things easier, but some don't think this goes far enough. Right, well, this woman I talked to today, she is a patient. She relies on the low THC oil program to get her through her ailments. Now, she says the state needs to do more to really help people get the access that they need much more quickly. It's not about just being high. It's about being medicated so you can live. Yolanda Bennett credits medical cannabis for helping her through her many ailments. Peripheral neuropathy, osteoarthritis. Papilledema. She's utilizing the low THC oil program in Georgia, but there came a time when her card expired. Wait a month and a half to get my card just to get my meds. So you already know what I felt like during that time. I felt horrible. The Department of Public Health just announced some big changes in an effort to make things easier. Cards are now valid for five years instead of two. You can also get it mailed to you through the online portal. However, the cost has gone up to $30. The changes are welcomed, but some feel the state should take it a step further. You're waiting on your medical cannabis card. You should be able to get it instantly. Judson Hill operates Fine Federal Dispensary, one of the few in Georgia. Many of these people have end stage of life conditions. Every day matters for better quality, for helping them find healing. The Department of Public Health said in an email to Atlanta News First that the cards can take up to 10 business days to arrive, but usually it takes around five. They also say right now the same day option is just not feasible. The same day option is what's needed. You go to your medical doctor, you get your prescription, you take it to the pharmacy, you get your medicine the same day. Now, right now, there are 17 qualifying conditions that will help you get access to this card. Of course, that will also need to be certified by your doctor. We're live in Smyrna tonight. Bridget Spencer, Atlanta News First. A manhunt in Coweta County tonight.